What's up, doll collectors, hobbyists, fabs, and besties? I'm Toya, an adult doll collector. Welcome to my miniverse. I always do this. I think I can craft faster than I actually can. I got two days. Let's remodel a whole room. Um, no. I'm gonna need a little more time. Because I might have taken off to watch the Barbie movie. Which has me all in my feelings right now. Wasn't expecting that. So I'm taking a mini brands break. Series 5. Plus, there are some minis that I still need to find. So get ready for some bubbly happy fun, unless we find doubles. And I love how in this series we no longer have wedges. Just a capsule that opens with paper bags inside. We are hoping to find a Frozen Moments mini or a hot glue gun. And our first one is a box from UPS. I love the mini boxes. However, last time we kept getting miniature cereal, which I also have feelings about. So hopefully we get something different this time. No, <laughs> it's miniature cereal because of course it is. In our last Mini Brands Series 5 video, many of you said to use them as single serving cereal boxes. So that is an option, but I just want the regular ones. And this is, it's a can of soup. Chunky beef with country vegetables. Let's put it on the shelf near the chili. Opening our third bag and we have tape. This is a double for us, but I do love office supplies. And this is a giant can of soda. Coca-Cola, zero sugar. I like the little can details on the top. And up next is a bag of chips. Sorry, I keep getting this one. Let's try again because those doubles are not giving me warm, fuzzy feelings. I need the hot glue gun. That's tape. You know what though? The dolls can never have enough tape. Can you imagine running out in the middle of a craft? It's terrible. Double. Yup, more beef with country vegetables. We're gonna need more shelf space. Because I glued down those cans of chili, so they're kind of stuck there. Chocolate fudge cream filled wafers. I feel like we've seen this one before. Oh, that's because we have. And what could this be? Feels like a can of some kind. Oh yeah, Pringles, original. And our last one for this capsule is designer highlighters, a pack of four. Cool. It's totally office supplies. However, they do look glued together. But if we get a double, I will totally see if we can separate them. So now we're looking for new highlighters, the hot glue gun, and more Frozen Moments minis. This is salsa and a double, but that's okay because doubles do look good on the shelf when you are stocking a mini grocery store. And here we have another can of soda, Sprite, zero sugar. In my opinion, this can is a little large for our dolls, but I think we could totally do it anyway if we really want to. Here we have a FedEx box. Please don't be little tiny cereal. Okay, it's a little tiny Slurpee. Here it is with a doll and a Disney Dorable and Chelsea. And it looks like a pretty good size for Chelsea. I think this might be chips of some kind. Let's see. Oh no! It's candy, jelly beans, buttered popcorn, which is a double for me, but it could be fun in like a doll movie theater scene. And our last one for this capsule is Campbell's Sauces Skillet, Chicken Marsala. Another double. I am not giving up. We are going to find that hot glue gun. Be positive, Toya. And this is <laughs> buttered popcorn, jelly beans. But 
that's just one, and we have four more to go in this capsule. Uh, more popcorn. What is with all this popcorn? Could the miniverse be trying to tell me something? <laughs> nah. Let's keep looking for that hot glue gun. This is post-it notes. Now it is a double for us, but that's okay because we are being positive. We are going to find a hot glue gun or a double C or a frozen moments mini. And oh, we did it. We have the V8 original vegetable juice frozen moments mini. This is our second Frozen Moments Mini from Series 5. And it looks like we are pouring the vegetable juice into a glass and it is splashing. Love it. I love Frozen Moments for doll photos. All right, we're going to try our positive thinking with Disney Dorval Series 10. This is a mini peek with Disney 100 celebrating 100 years of wonder. This is box E101 with two or three mini figures inside. Now we want Atlantis. So hopefully we will find it or we will find it through positivity. This is bag 36 and the adorable inside is the rare Kronk from Emperor's New Groove. Not the one we were looking for, but it's not a double. This is bag 42. And the figure inside is Dodger from Oliver and Company. And this one is fuzzy. It's actually a pretty cute little adorable. Let's try again. This is box E133. And I have a good feeling about this because we're being positive. We're being positive. And the mini inside or the minis inside are numbers 43 and 03. Inside bag 43, we have another dog, ultra rare Georgette from Oliver and Company. This one is also fuzzy and she can have a seat next to Tink. This is bag number three. And it is, oh no, a double, <laughs> okay. It's our second Lenny from Toy Story. Wow, our little theater seating is almost full. In the comments of this video, some of you wanted to know if we can make the same seating for Barbie. These seats are made out of craft foam, so we can try, but I don't know if it's going to be sturdy enough. I looked through my supplies and found some craft foam. It's a little less than a quarter inch thick. I cut a seven by three inch rectangle of pink and black. I cut three inches from both for the seat and back of the chair. Keep in mind, we are experimenting here. This may or may not work. For the sides, it looks like we'll need four and a half inches. I cut the sides from the black craft foam, giving us two rectangles that are two and three quarter inches by four and a half. And I cut a half inch strip of pink for the armrest. I take the two squares for the seat and glue them together. I'm using a generous amount of hot glue, but making sure to stay away from the edges, just so it doesn't spill out. And I'm hoping the hot glue will add a little strength. Repeat for the back of the chairs, glue the seat to the back of the chair, glue on the sides, and two layers of craft foam glued together actually feels pretty sturdy. However, the sides might need a little help. So I cut another piece of craft foam to glue underneath, then add the last side to make a chair out of craft foam that can hold our doll. All we have to do now is add armrest and we have a very easy and quick theater chair. I didn't glue the armrest down yet because I want to add more seats and we're going to need to trim the armrest between the chairs. Now let's cut more craft foam and make another seat and back. Glue it onto the other chair so they share an armrest. Glue another support underneath then the other side. Repeat to make more 
Trim the armrest that go between the seats and glue them down. Add armrest on the ends and we have seating for three. Since it's foam, we can even bend the back a little to make the chairs more comfy for the dolls. Make more than one and we have a movie theater seating display for our dolls. Oh, and we can give them the buttered popcorn jelly beans. Look at that. It was meant to be. Thank you for joining us while we checked out Mini Brand Series 5, found a new Frozen Moment Mini, added a few Disney Dorables to our movie theater display, and made a larger one to fit Barbies. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to ring the bell and follow us on Instagram at my froggy stuff the frog vlog and bella of my froggy stuff and we will see you next time